there needs to be that shift and and that cultural shift to uh, understanding that uh, unless you move into that proactive space and uh, you know and as I mentioned those those five pillars then now uh, we're only ever going to be reacting so I give the example to um, to some of our um, management team around we want to be three fences back from the cliff you know like it's all very well to have services at the bottom of the cliff where we can uh, pick people up and and patch them up and and support them to get well away and that that that's lovely and um, you know we're always going to if the wheels fall off we'll we'll most certainly do what we can to support you but um, unless you start thinking about you know things being a little bit further back and being proactive um, and looking at the business in itself um, and how you're how how you are for people um, and realizing that people you know unless that whole culture of health is there then um, you're, you'll always be picking up the pieces, if you like, and um, and that will always be a problem for your business. So, um, yeah, I think there's a there's a long way to go. So, if we use your analogy, then you've got the ambulance at the bottom of the cliff, you've got the fence on the cliff edge, you've got the next fence and the next fence. Where do you think the majority of the mining industry currently sits in relation to protecting against psychological injury? Might be a weak fence at the top of the at the top of the cliff. Yeah, okay. if I'm really honest. Yeah. Um, hey, you know, I like I'd like to fluff it up a bit and say, look, our industry is is really um, doing well. And and don't get me wrong, there are some businesses that are doing exceptionally well, and there's there's a lot going on, in, you know, some of those bigger businesses. But um, you know, some of the smaller businesses, they they need some help. And um, yeah, the, these sort of things that you guys are doing is is really going to help with that. 